Dr. Hussein Barack Obama is guilty of big government and deficit spending. And I think he should be given um, probation because he's a good man generally. Um, he seems to be doing this not for selfish motives but to help out the citizens so that um, with a recommendation of the uh, prosecution I will give him uh, probation. I'll give him um, two to six years in probation. And so, um, why would he want to, you know, commit this crime? The answer is that the economic times demand it. Actually, what would help out in this recessionary, almost meltdown time is if individuals start spending, and governments and businesses start investing and we start exporting more. The government is spending in big business and deficit spending. But in big government, I believe that the way I interpret big government is that you're hiring and creating more agencies and, and, and so on. And this is a way to be able to give people buying power. They will earn some money so they could go out and spend and help things to move and when they start spending businesses would get smart and say you know we better invest and we better expand to meet the demand and uh, of course if we could beat the price debacle and get things very economical then we could start beating um, you know competition and doing some more exporting and so because he is uh, altruistic in his big government and deficit spending and there's no evidence of any corruption, cover-up or kickback that um, we will just give him probation, give him six years probation, um, two to six years, and hope that before this time is over, um, we will see that uh, it was justified and perhaps we will just end everything there.